if you want to learn how to make these incredibly moist and soft and fluffy banana chocolate chip muffins please keep watching what i love about this recipe is that it's super easy to come together it has many chocolate chips so that you get tons of chocolatey bites throughout the whole muffin so let's get started so let's get started with our dry ingredients and in a bowl you're going to add your ap flour you're going to add your baking powder you're going to add your baking soda you're going to add your salt and you're going to add your cinnamon and you're going to give this a really good whisk until fully combined and now we can get started with our wet ingredients we are going to use ripe bananas so i have three fairly large ripe bananas and this is the color that it should look like on the outside and i'm going to put them in a bowl and i'm going to smash it up until it gets to this consistency very few lumps all smashed up now we're going to add our egg and we are going to add our melted butter and our maple syrup our vanilla extract and we are going to add the brown sugar and the granulated sugar I'm gonna give all of this a really good whisk until everything is fully combined our egg is fully incorporated and all the ingredients are as incorporated as they can be and we are going to set this aside and get our dry ingredients Okay, now I'm going to add my dry ingredients and I'm just going to use a rubber spatula and kind of fold this in until it's combined. You don't want to overwork it because you don't want to um, overwork and create too much gluten. So if you see some lumps, that is totally fine. Um, and once you get it to about this consistency, then you are good to go. So it takes about... I don't know like seven to ten folds um, kind of gauge as far as the consistency goes to what this is and now we're ready to add our mini chocolate chips so we're going to add um, the mini chocolate chips but I reserved um, about like three tablespoons so that I can add over the muffins and um, I'm just gonna fold this in gently and this is the way it should look like and now we're ready to scoop our muffins so I have my muffin tin and I'm gonna fill it up with um, my muffin liners and I'm using a four ounce cookie scoop and I'm gonna fill each of them up um, and then I'm gonna have my oven preheated to 400 degrees and now that my muffins are all scooped I'm just gonna pour in some of the mini chocolate chips in them as you guys can see they're looking fully chocolate chip loaded I mean you see tons of them so you don't have to add too many if you don't want um, but you know I like to add a little extra just for that chocolatey effect um, and now let's get to baking them and I'm gonna bake these muffins for five minutes and I'm gonna drop the temperature down to 350 degrees and I'm gonna bake these for another eight to ten minutes So my ovens are out of the oven and they look gorgeous. Look at all those little chocolate chips. I like to use mini chocolate chips for this recipe because I like to have little bites of chocolate everywhere. Um, and they are so yummy. They smell so great. Let's bite into them. Let's see how they look on the inside. So here are our banana muffins and they're fully loaded with mini chocolate chips. They are so delicious. As we unwrap them, they have perfect texture and each bite is filled with little bites and puddles of chocolate, which is so yummy and it's super soft and fluffy. It has a great banana flavor. 
I love that like extra cinnamon that kind of gives it a little bit of a warmth and the brown sugar and the maple syrup just really brings us home with the perfect amount of sweetness. I really hope you guys enjoyed this recipe. It was super easy to make. And if you liked this video, please subscribe to my channel and give it a like. Thank you. See you guys next time.